Hello, my name is Andrea Brockhoff and I'm a medical student and I've been asked to perform an abdominal examination on you. It's just going to involve me having a look at your hands, a look at your face, feel around your tummy and then a listener. Is that alright? Yep, that's okay. Okay, so can I just ask you to strip off into your underwear now? Okay. In general inspection, remember to include the patient's surroundings. Okay, I'm just going to start off by having a look at your hands now. And can I just get you to oppose your index fingers like this for me? Clubbing is a loss of the nail bed angle. As there are many causes of clubbing, its presence does not confirm a diagnosis, but instead should inform your thinking. Okay, that's fine, thank you. And if I can just get you to stick out your arms like this, cock back your wrists and spread your fingers. Okay, that's fine, thank you. Okay, I'm just going to have a look in your eyes now. If you could look up, I'm going to pull down on your eyes. Okay, look down for me. Okay, and let me have a look in your mouth. And underneath your tongue. Okay, that's fine, thank you. Pay particular attention to Verkov's node, as much of the gut drains here. Know your scars and make sure you don't miss one. Knowledge of the anatomy and surgical procedures may give you a valuable insight into the patient's history. Do you have any pain at all in your tummy at the moment? No, I don't. Remember, an OSCE is like a driving test. You need to make it clear to the examiner what you are doing. For deep palpation, it's a good idea to use two hands. Okay. I'm just going to do the same thing again, just press a little deeper. And if I can just get you to breathe in and out deeply when I say so. Okay, breathe in, and out, and in, and out, and in, and out. Okay, and the same thing again. Breathe in, and out, and in, and out, and in, and out. Okay. An expansile pulsation should make you suspicious of aortic aneurysm.
Thank you very much. You can put your shirt back on. All right.